Maybe I shouldn't touch that yet, because it seems to break all the electronics in the area. Corrupted, de 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 detected. Restore files, yes. Partial data recovery successful. What's the earliest one? I guess this one. decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsanka to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. <laughs> I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right. I'll pass on the mole check. Josie, I'll be going for evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Cal. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys. I'm Peter Strass, can dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. All right, Johnson. Have a safe trip. Okay, this is late next day. Hey, hello, Beta. Absalon, what's up? We could really use direct contact with Heather. Uh, I mean, uh, site service engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Lumar relays are basically junk at this point. You can send messages via the comm center, but if you want, I'm pretty much always here, ready to relay anything by hand. I, I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. All right, we just have to make do. Got you later. Okay, now this one's a few days later. Hello, Peter, was it? Yes, I'm here. What's up? We're getting out. I just want to tell you that I'm going to seal the comm center now, so this is definitely the last you'll hear from us. If we don't show up in the next couple of hours, send in the cavalry. Hang on, what's happening? It's still the same plan, right? Yup. We'll head for the shuttle and ride it directly to Theta. Okay, good. I'll rally the troops for a welcome party. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Okay. So, Semkin died, but Azaro probably got out? Because she left the note? Oh man, there's so much to read <laughs> in this game. I want to be, I want to focus on like the lore and everything, but there's so much to read. Jonesy, I know you have a much better chance for survival, but we have the better view. Salud. What the heck? <sighs> Dear Miss Vidgis. John's daughter. It's with great sadness I have to inform you that the office will close and can no longer support Upsilon and Pathos 2. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you, your supervisor Jane Adams, and the rest of the staff. You are a terrific group, and it's with great confidence I say there that where we fall, you will surely carry on with bravery. Update on the defense measurements. Final efforts by the global community to prevent collision has failed. Pathos 2 should make any final efforts to deal with the inevitable quake following impact. The office is closing down and everyone is being evacuated. From everyone here, I want to say it's been an honor working with you in Upsilon. Godspeed and good luck with the apocalypse. Okay, so there was some kind of global apocalypse that happened. It's not just this facility. Let's touch this now. Ugh. That's nothing. Um, okay, so I just broke this one computer. This must be the comm system. Oh no, a password. I think she was at Lambda, right? I need to get in touch with Lambda? 2203? Hey, are you there? I found the dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Simon, was it? 
Uh, Jared, Simon Jared. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Me? I was hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Where do you even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where did you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pathos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. Have you seen any people? Like staff or field technicians? Only robots. Crazy ones. Except for one. I think he said his name was Carl. He was okay, but I'm... I'm pretty sure I accidentally killed him by turning off the power. Oh. Well, you know, robots don't feel anything, so... Good point. Yeah. What was that? No! What's going on? I think this place is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? There are two trains connecting all the sites. Find one and come here. I'll wait for you. Oh, shit. Okay. Shit. What do I do? Shit, shit. where do I... <laughs> That's what I'm wondering. Oh, okay. I don't have to do anything. Fair enough. Am I a robot? I didn't actually think about having a body. <laughs> I, I, I completely slipped my mind. <laughs> There's no explanation for how he has a human body. If, if he got transported into the future from the scanning machine. I guess maybe I thought he just like took over some poor unfortunate pilot's body <laughs> or something. But maybe I'm... Maybe I'm a robot. Anyway. Back in the ocean. Oh. Was I supposed to... There we go. Wait. Click? There we go. Just click. <clears throat> so just like that other robot that thought he was human. Maybe I'm a robot. And the like human form and then putting on a, a scuba suit or whatever I'm wearing is just the brain's way of coping with the fact that you're not in a human body you're like hallucinating Lambda, find the shuttle to Lambda yeah let's not get distracted there better not be any massive fish monsters I need to collect some coral shell samples, some coral plate samples. Wow, I can't believe that didn't work. Oh, is this, this is the door that was leaking water, maybe. Yeah, I bet it is. Okay. I wonder what would happen if I had pushed that door button, cause I kind of forgot about it, but it wasn't red. Are these fish, like, monster fish? They look like regular fish. Okay. I don't know what any of these are. I seriously doubt any of these doors are gonna open. I need to be... ...thorough. I don't want to miss anything. I imagine this is the right way to go because it's like lit up and that's like a, a common tactic in game development to show the correct path is just to have lights on it. I say that but <laughs> I seem to have instantly run into a dead end. Oh those fish do look fucked up. 
Oh yeah, they're like they are monster fish. It's got to be that structure gel that some somebody was talking about. Structure gel just like messed up everything. And the robots, the like crazy robots must be just people's minds that got trapped in the robots and then went insane. Oh, there's like a... A ship or something. What is this? Oh. Come in, Theta. You better answer me, Strasky. Come on! Amy, where, where are you? In the field. I had to leave. Is Carl with you? It all went to hell. Hold on. You got the power automated, right? The, the plant is safe. We need the power to keep the sites running. No, oh, fuck the power! Fuck you, Strasky! The machines killed Carl. Oh shit. All right, um, calm down. It'll, it'll be okay. Can you get back to Theta? Yeah. I think so. I'll head for the shuttle, the Ox. Good luck, Amy. Rooting for you. Okay, so we're just kind of following Amy's footsteps. She ran off from the robot, but Carl was fatally wounded. And she got through that door that was probably leaking water and left the note for everybody not to not to come back. And now we're just kind of following her here. Uh-oh. Um, that doesn't look good. I should not. I should not let that see me. Where is it going? I thought that- I thought the dust I kicked up- Yeah, structure gel. They're crazy for it. <gasps> they want my gel! <laughs> They're after my gel, my- my juicy gel. This is a dead end? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. This looks like something I need to interact with, though. Is it really a dead end? I don't... I don't get it. Okay. I think I have to get around him the other way. Is that him sucking up gel? How did I get here? What are you doing out here? I'm going. I'm going. Whew. That could have been close. I have no idea how close that was because I don't really know, like, how well aliens can- or not aliens. Why do I keep saying aliens? <laughs> I don't know how well the robots can see. What's this guy? It looks like he's got a gun or something. Are you going to shoot me? This one seems okay, like it's an actual robot that's not corrupted by structure gel or a human mind. 
Am I just following him? Crab. 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 I guess maybe he's following me. I shouldn't just sit around waiting for him to move. Maybe he'll, like, defend me if I accidentally alert a bad guy. I haven't really been paying attention to, like, signs. I don't know if, if it's been saying, like, where I need to go or not. I'm getting that staticky stuff, which makes me think there might be a monster around here. Whoops, hold on. Upsilon. I don't want to go to Upsilon. I want to go to Lambda. Oh shit, I didn't see that thing. I didn't see that thing at all. I, I don't know if I just got super lucky there that I didn't get attacked. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Maybe I should have just stayed on the path I was on. That seemed to be the right way. Where is it? Oh, it's still there. Yeah, let's just let's keep going this way. I don't know if there's like like secrets, quote unquote secrets that you can find. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Shut that light off. No. Stop. Be quiet. I can't see. I can't see the bad guy. Okay, I think stop. Shut up. Oh, shit, it's so close. It's just like sit... Sitting around this boat. I just want to back up and study it a little bit better. I think this is where we have to go. I really wish it would stop shining that light in my face. I don't know how to get around this thing. It looks so dangerous. It's this little camera is blinding me. Please tell me I can squeeze through here. Oh, it's like kind of letting me sometimes. I think I almost got through. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's not gonna let me through. That's bad. can't see. Ugh. I feel like I almost slipped through a second ago. No, it's, it's not letting me. I'm just running. Okay, so we didn't quite make it to Lambda, but we made it to Upsilon. Oh, can you fix it? Oh, you're so helpful. 
Maybe I could have just done this. I don't know how to work this. All right, whatever. Thanks. Well, thanks, little guy. See ya. Godspeed, little robot. Swipe Omni tool. Yeah, let's do that. From my brain, from your mind. I assume I have to turn this off when I'm trying to be sneaky. she fixed it that would be nice for me if she fixed it although it looks like it looks like they're just fucked it looks like I'm not getting through there oh I guess maybe that's Carl maybe these are all Amy's drawings is this actually what I need to get? Seven transistors, seven screws. <laughs> Probably not, right? This was just her attempts at fixing it. Shuttle beat. Epsilon and theta. Um, that doesn't really help. Impact event. This morning of January 12th. The comet Telos crashed into the Pacific Ocean. Okay, well, there's the um, um, pff, apocalypse. The impact ranks as one of the largest collisions ever recorded on Earth. All evidence indicates that the surface has gone completely barren and is no longer able to sustain life. Pathos 2's unique location has provided unparalleled safety for, safety for our staff. Some structural damage has been noted. But no casualties reported. The largest loss was the weather and communication station located on the surface platform Omega unmanned, which is under circumstances a small price to pay. Theta will hold an emergency meeting to discuss the future of Pathos 2 and ultimately mankind. Overseer K. Farquirian. Farquirian. I guess that's a good thing we never had any kids. Hard enough looking my parents in the eyes. They're going to a bomb shelter upstate, by the way. Along with your dad. I'm guessing someone will help him send you a message somehow. I mean, I hope they will. Hell, I'm not even sure you'll get this message. If you do, I want you to know I never blamed you for following your dreams. It just... I was just mad it didn't fit better with what I imagined our lives would be. I really wanted the picket fence, big family, you know. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I'm proud of you. And even though it's been difficult to be separated from you, I regret nothing. I'm happy. And I really wish I was able to say this without the sky falling down. I love you, Amy. I always have, and always will. Oh, that was really sad. So that's not Carl. This is like her husband that sh that she left behind. And there's the the big house with the picket fence. 
Aw, that's sad. Okay, well. Insufficient power. Maybe this will fix it. Uh oh. Jesus Christ! What the hell? That one didn't like me. Uh, no, I'm all there now. 